Will Ferrell has reacted to the backlash over his new documentary which is titled Will and Harper. Will has faced backlash recently after the trailer was released for his new documentary. The documentary seems to center around Will's friendship with Harper after her transition a few years ago. The two are traveling across the country in order to soul search and figure out the country's attitude towards people who have transitioned. Some fans have slammed Will saying that he shouldn't be using his platform to promote Harper and her beliefs or people who have transitioned. They say that he is enabling Harper and that he shouldn't be friends with her anymore. Other fans have stuck up for Will saying that it shows how important his his friendship with Harper is to him. He is undertaking this journey with her in order to learn more about who she is now and raise awareness for people who have transitioned. And now, a source has spoken up to the press and revealed how Will Ferrell feels about all of the backlash he's getting over the documentary and for supporting his trans friend. In their statement, the source close to Will said, Will was pressured by some people not to do this project because of the hatred and controversy surrounding trans people in the media, but Will supports his friend through and through and did not back down. He thinks this is a beautiful thing to share with the world and wants as many people as possible to see it. And who knows, he thinks maybe this will change some people's mindset. It's clear to see how much Will values his friendship with Harper and he is being very brave to push back against all of the people who didn't want him to make the documentary. People who have transitioned will be very proud of him. One fan said, this is exactly why I love Will Ferrell. He's not afraid to stand up for what's right even when it's unpopular. It's heartwarming to see him support his friend Harper like this. The world needs more people like him. Another fan said, I'm disappointed in Will Ferrell. He's just trying to be politically correct and virtue signal. This whole documentary feels like a forced attempt to be woke. I'm not interested in watching it. For this video, comment question will you be watching the documentary before you go be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for daily news updates on your favorite celebs thanks a lot for watching